Hello everybody. Gabriel turned eight months old on Saturday, so we are here to give you his eight month update. So keep watching if you want to see more. So it's always helpful to me when I was reading updates for other babies to hear the stats because I like to compare my baby to other babies, which I know you shouldn't do, but it helps you feel a little more normal. So we're going to start off with the stats. He is clocking in at 21 pounds, which I thought that he would in the seven month update, and he has. We tried to measure him this morning, but if you have ever tried to measure a baby not at a doctor's office, it is very difficult. But we think he's 28 inches, which is awesome because that means he grew in some lengthwise. <laughs> he is wearing size 4 diapers and size, or he's in 12 month clothing. One really big development for the entire family is that he is sleeping all night in his crib. No more co-sleeping. <laughs> and he's sleeping about 11 hours at night. He wakes up once or twice. We get really lucky when he gives us about a five hour stretch, but typically it's a three or four hour. Uh, he's been fighting naps recently, really, really hard. Today is a perfect example. He's only had one. He usually has three. <laughs> so that has been very challenging. I think he's going through another sleep regression, which I read that it could be an eight, nine, or ten month sleep regression. So that could be the case. Another big thing that could also be the reason why his sleep isn't great is he has four teeth. Two on the top and two on the bottom. It makes breastfeeding very, very interesting. Tell me in the comments if you breastfed and when your child got teeth, how you handled it. Because he's not really biting, it's just uncomfortable. He is sitting on his own completely unassisted. We can plop him in the middle of the floor and he will happily entertain himself. He uh, only falls back a couple of times and has bonked his head, but nothing too terribly bad. Crawling wise, no like full on crawling yet, but he's getting really close. Just today, he's barely started to army crawl, which is exciting. He, his favorite mode of transportation though is rolling. He can roll really, really quickly. <laughs> you all right? <laughs> uh, we used to be able to put him in the middle of our king size bed and go into the bathroom and get ready or do whatever. But now he rolls so <laughs> quickly that we can't do that. We have to keep a constant eye on him all the time. Not that we didn't before, but we have to be even more diligent. <laughs> He is laughing and giggling and is very vocal, but he always has been. <laughs> Probably the cutest new thing that he does is that he growls and it is hilarious. We don't really know where it came from. He just started doing it one day and he's been doing it ever since and it's very, very funny. <laughs> He is still predominantly breastfed, and I still pump at work during the day Oh, I'm away from him and Jacob gives him bottles. Uh, we've introduced some, several more solid foods, and he is taken to them very well. We have no issues with feeding him. He's tried <laughs> pears, which he really liked, green peas, which he also liked. His favorite so far, though, has been apples and sweet potatoes. He really likes those. For his loves and his hates, he still loves to watch children. Anytime children are around, he will be endlessly fascinated. He likes clapping. He likes when you make him clap and play patty cake. He still likes his bouncer. Probably, excuse you. Probably not as much as he really used to, but he still likes it in there. He likes when you dance crazy at him, and we think he likes music too. And he started this new cute thing that his maga taught him. We think it's his version of dancing. For his hates, right now he really hates being put down for a nap. A lot. <laughs> he still does not like being put into his car seat. 
I don't know if it's a, he's being confined, but he'll puff out his chest and go straight and make it really difficult. Um, he chews on everything. He will put anything <laughs> near him in his mouth. When we were at the wedding the other day, he definitely leaned forward and chewed on the pew in front of us. Nothing is safe anymore. <laughs> Even when you try to feed him and you put the spoon in his mouth, he'll clamp down too soon with his teeth, and you have a hard time getting it out. He has been for a while saying what we think are a couple of words. We think he's saying dad and dad dad. I don't know if he's saying it when he thinks of Jacob or is referencing Jacob to it, but he definitely is making those noises. He's saying hi. Again, I don't know if he's literally saying hi or just making the sound. But he's generally pretty vocal. about wraps up his eight month update. Thank you for watching. Tell us in the comments how you handled the eight month sleep regression and also how you handle teeth plus breastfeeding equals yay. <laughs> um, subscribe to our channel to see more videos. You want him to do it too? Click the bell so it notifies you when there's a new one. And check out some of our other videos to learn some more about us. And we will see you at his nine month update.